This is code.org. I'm currently working on CS Principles, Unit 5, Building Apps, Lesson 15, Processing Arrays, Puzzle 7. For loop with if. Ah, this is going to get tricky. Sometimes we want to find values in an array that meet certain conditions. We can add an if statement inside the for loop to individually check every value within the array, right? As we iterate through the array with our i um, used for the index, uh, we can use an if statement to check every single part of our array. To practice this, we will create a for loop that will display every value in an array greater than 5. Starter code has been provided that creates an array of random values. Add a for loop that references every value in the array. Add an if statement inside the for loop, and what they want us to do is use the uh, dot length to get the length of the array and make i less than it. And again, this works because i starts at zero, okay? So keep in mind, this is less than, not less than or equal to. So if I have an array of three, it's going to say my array dot length will equal three, okay? But we start at an index of zero. So it will run through the first time and say i is zero, run through, look at that index, go back, add one to i, drop in, run through, go back, i is now 1, so 1 plus 1 is 2, drop in, run through, go back, and now i is 3, and it says, oh, 3, and I'm going to stop, because it has to be less than the length. But that still goes through every element, because we started at 0. So add an if statement inside the for loop that displays every value of the array greater than 5. Note, because the original array is being constructed with random values, it's possible that it might not have any value greater than 5. Just run the program a few times to make sure it works. Ah, okay. So let's check this out. We're going to do something similar. I'm going to grab our for loop. And let me get some space. Okay. And so now I have a for loop. And now we are going to want to use my array dot length again right so like i was saying earlier we're going to use that and then we're going to use our if because they said we want to check a condition now what condition do we want to check well we want to check if my array at index i so whatever index we're currently on when we're looping is greater than five because if it's greater than five that's when we're going to ask the computer to do something and it said to log it to the console so Um, more. Ah, I won't write anything. I'll just write my array i. All right, just trying to think of something witty. Let's see if this works. So it should. That looks good. Values greater than five. Oh, they already had that included up here. Got it. Yep, and we're getting every value greater than 5, because it's going through every element, every index in our array. Awesome. Let's keep going. 